Brian, what's going on, man? Hey, man, I got this problem. I call it the curse. I got, like, a lot of things going on. Good job on my home. Great dad to my kids. You know, got a lot of stuff happening for me. But for some reason, I get hooked up with these chicks, and they all end up leaving me for, like, an ex-boyfriend who's, like, You want to know why? Okay. I'll tell you why right now. But guys with no job or nothing. Because like, you know, bums, bums treat women like bums. And for real, for real, bum guys bring women down to that level where they feel like they're above the girl. You don't you put women on pedestals I can hear your fucking mouth right now. <laughs> you don't have to treat them like shit, but you have to be a certain way where they think you're better than them. Women do not respond to 50-50 or or they run the relationship. You ha it has to be at least 60-40 on your side. It has to trickle down from you. You got to learn how to be an asshole. <laughs> I'm serious. That's why they leave you, because you ask any woman in the world who their favorite boyfriend was ever in their life, and she'll tell you he was a fucking asshole. The problem is not every guy can do that. Nope. That's a real True. problem. You and can't I don't change mean your asshole. basic nature. Wait a minute, no, Jeffrey. Yeah. And I don't mean asshole like, fuck you, bitch, duh, duh, duh. I mean asshole like, this fucking asshole. You could be a smooth asshole. Yeah. I happen to not be a smooth asshole. <laughs> I think Jeffrey is a smooth but, asshole. But Dante's a smooth <laughs> asshole. But that's why a lot of women, Jeffrey has been their favorite or Dante's been their favorite. You understand? Where you have a chick in your life for 10 years. And you be like, damn, she's just been hanging around for 10 fucking years. I've been going with this girl for 10. Go ahead, sweetie. I'm sorry. I, I, I just wanted to say this. Um, I'm, <clears throat> I think you have a very realistic view. I mean, I'm not going to deny that. I think in a lot of ways for a lot of women and some men who think in those same contexts that you do, which is very general, like a lot of people do think that way. I think it is true. But I think <clears throat> at the same time, um, you know, with that said, like, you know, there's something that's unattractive when a man puts forth that he needs a woman indefinitely like and i think that's unattractive for anyone like i need you like i want you to want me and i want your love. now what like, she's saying me. what she's saying is i want a guy that don't want me exactly yeah. Yeah. what she's saying what she said what she said what she said in goofy girl talk no, 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 no offense beautiful i love you know i love you what she said in that way oh, but i'm trying to talk man way because what you just said i'm he's trying not to gonna understand he's not gonna understand that what she's saying he's is, translate it. women are after. Here's what women do: <clears throat> they come after a man, and they want him. They want to see. They say, "Oh, this dude is cool as a motherfucker. This dude got a how." They look for things that they can innately, not maliciously, bring down. Like they go, "I want to just make this motherfucker less sexy." You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. If you stay, I'm telling you. What she's saying yeah. is when you when the woman gets you to go, I love you too, booby bear, she goes, Thank God I got this faggot now. <laughs> oh no. See, Thank goodness. See, you but it's 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 not malicious. It's human it's human nature. It's it's not malicious. It's very similar to how men can can interest after saying? the conquest. I yeah. think when you when you get that higher level of consciousness, you move beyond that superficial like Oh, if he says that, then I won't like him. Like, I only want what I can't have. All that childish, immature stuff. I'm talking about when someone loves me, I want them to love me and want me, not because they need me, because that means okay. they need me. But, <clears> but here's what you're, what you're uh, really trying to espouse is like all relationships are somewhat toxic, where a man has to behave in a negative manner in order didn't to... Didn't say that, didn't say well, that. Well, no, asshole. I would, I, I <clears> that's would a negative a, connotation. Yes, but, it is a negative connotation. But at, when I mean but, asshole, when I mean asshole is that you have this thing. I'm trying to talk it in plain terms. I don't you need understand? You. What he's saying Where is it's I don't like need you. you have this thing like this motherfucker is just you're not sure how much I don't give a shit about you. Whether I do or not, you just like this motherfucker don't give a fuck. Oh, so that you're saying that attracts a woman more. Absolutely. I get especially, it. Though. Especially the more attractive the woman, because she's so used though. to people doing whatever she wants. Yeah. Oh. Women don't take that well. If you no. don't, if you if you well, withdraw some of the power, that well, you know, they don't take that, that well. That can be seen I'm, in two ways. And what I'm trying to say is, at, you can see that as, oh, I can be an a-hole, or you can see that as, like, I w real love is not about. Needing. Like, I, if I don't have, I need you. It's about want. Like, hey, Brian, hold on, hold on a second. I don't have to have Brian, let me ask you this. Let me, Brian, Brian, Brian. Hold on a second, hold on a second. Hold on, I'm sorry, I'm sorry to cut you off. Wait, I'm going to ask this guy a question.
What what is your method of operation with all these girls that leave you for bums? What is your thing? Because I tend to believe this. Never forget, it's not their fault, Brian. Never never blame it on the women. They like fish. They just do stuff. They don't. They don't think. They just do oh, shit. Oh my gosh. <laughs> no, but you know what? Wait, wait, Brian. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Let me talk to Brian. Let me yeah, talk to Brian. Yeah. Moving about. Let me talk. Sorry. No, I mean, I'll let y'all get in. Come on. We got hours to go. Um, <laughs> Brian, what has been your mo in terms of what you what you do? What's your, what's your brand in terms of how you treat women? If I, like, if I feel like there's connection with them, I mean, I treat Ugh. them great. Ugh. Do you feel that? Yeah, I get now, immediately, yeah, oh, yeah. immediately, yeah. Uh, immediately a pimp's stomach what, just... Why are you making face? Oh, God. I can't uh, immediately, immediately a mm. pimp's stomach just turns. turns when he goes, connection. connection. Those are <laughs> vaginal words, dude. No guy gives a fuck about a connection. We don't go out. Men don't go out to parties, right? And we all look at each other and go, fellas, we're going out to the club tonight. And we're going to find the last woman we're ever going to be with, we're gonna ever. Make, we're going to find someone I want to find. A come on, fellas, with. put it in. One, two, three. And Soulmate. Not happy. Oh. Now you're going to you're Connection oh, so on three. <laughs> one, two, three. Connection. <laughs> we we want to find the girl. Dude, right. you have to start to get a... This is what I want to bring up. You ever see the dog whisperer? Oh my God! He said actually. Did you ever see the dog whisper, Brian? No, I sure have. You ha everybody a, a out there pimp. has to watch the dog whisper. Now I know women innately are gonna go. Oh so my God! Dogs, dogs, women. Bleh. This is called context. Women don't get oh, this. Oh, you you, you try. <clears throat> they just went over the line. I'm there. not gonna go. Women I'm are trying. dogs, but there women is. Are dogs. Uh, no, no. I, I feel you. I feel. But your anger, that's just the sickness coming up. You need that. That's something bubbling up. I'm not angry. I'm not angry. I feel bad for you. Because a connection <laughs> and finding love, that's something that actually See, works. A connection is a word that I use. You're missing a part of love. I got a cop to that. You're missing a part of love. Brian, Brian, Brian man, thanks for calling, dude. Right, Keep you. listening, man. But Keep I listening. want to tell Brian one thing. Okay. If, and it's a psychological thing. If you notice a pattern that reoccurs in your life with several different people, but always the same thing happens, you are the only common denominator. Mm -hmm. The other people change, that but you true. keep showing but, up. No, for so men, but, let, but Jeffrey, often is with the, with the person Jeffrey let me squeeze in here. Let me say yes. this. Yes. Let me say this. It's never the woman's fault. Never. Women, I'm telling you, dude, women's behavior yeah, like is absolutely <laughs> is true. against okay. their Fuck it. They can't, they can't stop help it. it. They can't what? help it. Now you're saying we can't make they're, sense. They're, it's innate. I don't like that. You know what they like? I know you don't like a lot of things, sweetie. <laughs> it, they're like but the Hulk. They can't stop that angry thing. And let me get back to this fucking dog oh, whisperer. So all women okay. are angry. Listen, let me, let, Condoleezza, let me say something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I love it. Let me just explain this. Sure. You know I am generalizing. Okay? Yes. But... When Gross people when people take polls, do they poll everybody? No, you have to take you, a sample. You take. Yes, I do. I when you do field research. You have to take what I do is I I I do live performing, and when I do live performing and say certain things, I'm taking a poll to understand that the next time I do a show, I see the reaction. Then the next time I do a show, so basically what I'm saying. <clears throat> there has been some research done on it. And what I'm I'm not saying all women are like that, mm -hmm. but I'm saying all women are like that. 